Hey everyone, welcome to To Pickleball and Beyond. My name is Ryan. My name is Vino. And today we are looking at the Ultra X Competition Series by The Best Paddle. So please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you've been enjoying our content. It really helps us grow this yes. channel and keep providing content back to you guys. We love helping people find the paddle that's right for them. And make sure to stay tuned until the end of this video to hear about a giveaway. So, super excited to try this paddle out. Let's hear your initial thoughts. I mean, I have been waiting to get her hand on this paddle. Great branding. This is the brand by Jamie Foxx. Yes. And uh, um, they had some really great entry level paddles and some budget paddles. So, uh, we're very excited to get our hands on this. Overall, pretty good quality. Yeah, right? I, mean, I got to talk about the box. Let's talk about the box open. as well. It's coming with extra grips, not over grips. It's coming with extra grips. Lovely paddle case, uh, a cover rather. Um, and the eraser. Eraser. Really right? awesome packaging. Love the packaging. Um, I am very impressed with the grip. And the reason I say this is I have been trying some high-end paddles that you know people have been asking and we've been testing out. And the grip and the handle are just okay. Mm -hmm. This is another one where it feels nice. It's nice, it's plush, yes. um, well contour, control, uh, contoured. You, you feel those uh, vessels, so if you're moving around. This surface is this Kevlar carbon fiber mix. Mm -hmm. We did a Hudef with kind of the same thing, so go check that review as well. It's funny, there were some similarities if you think about how we played against that. Branding, beautiful, you have to tell anything about that. Um, how would you categorize this paddle? So I would certainly throw this um, as a control paddle personally, which is funny because that doesn't, that's not how the shape typically plays yeah. with the elongated. So it was really surprising that it played more as a control paddle in our eyes. Yeah, and uh, when we tested the weight, mm -hmm. it was around 8.0 and it felt that way. Yeah. You get what I mean? Yeah, you feel the full. Yes, way. and it's, it's really funny, like, you know, um, we have been testing couple of Kevlar paddles, right? And we kind of realized like these new ones coming out, it is wearing towards the control yep. and the power. Yep. And played very similarly. So let's go straight and talk how you felt the control of this paddle was. So that was definitely both of our highlights. And I know for you, I'm, I might toss yeah, it yeah, back yeah, yeah. to you, is when I was hitting drives at you with a different paddle, right? Yes. And how well this was handling it. Uh, I mean, you look like you're taking a vacation in the Bahamas. You're chilling, just relaxed. It's super easy to defend yourself. Uh, it, it had a rebound. There are some really soft paddles where it just sits and stays. Yeah. But this, it, it, it really absorbed that punch. Yeah. Let's put it that way. Rather yeah. than that, well, it absorbed that punch. It felt like, you know, you were able to take that power off and just kind of return Which it. Which made resets also really hard. Exactly, your third shot drops were really nice well. and even when you were dinking with it, mm -hmm. you really placed it well. I was very surprised on how well it kind of played, especially with this shape. Yeah, you know I thought I mean? the dinking was very nice, but to me what was even more impressive was how well it handled the fast pace yes. balls. Yes. That was the highlight. Yes, me. yes. Um, resets were beautiful with yes. it. Um, let's, let's go into the power side of it because when you played some of those volleys, mm -hmm. it did have power. Mm -hmm. Right? But it was not like a major power paddle. For yeah. Me. Let's just talk a little bit about that. Yeah. So I want to make sure we talk about the pop. Um, yes. This did not have much pop at all mm -hmm. to it, which yes. was very interesting. But yep. when, once I got to my full swings when I was doing overheads or some drives, then it got up to like a more, you know, this actually has a, a good amount of punch to it. Mm -hmm. But where it was lacking, and this is kind of that preference category, is the pop. So mm -hmm. if you're if you're a player that hits a lot of speed ups, I mm -hmm. think that's where this might not be a good option for you. Outside of that, I think it could be used by pretty much anyone. But yeah. again, very little pop to speak of. I mean, maneuverability um, up close, it, the swing weight's around 117, 118. Yeah. The twist weight's around um, 6.3. So, fairly maneuverable, you know what I mean? How did you feel like your, um, how fast were your hands playing with this? So, I think it kind of goes into this, um, you know, this elongated shape. I've been playing with a slightly shorter handle, mm -hmm. so I felt quicker than ever. Mm -hmm. So, I felt a little slower at the kitchen going back to this paddle, mm -hmm. but I think it's just due to what I had been playing with yes. recently. So, it's definitely not the fastest paddle at the net, but again, uh, the numbers, as yeah, you read, yes, yes, yes. It, it's 
Oh, it's right there. Yes, it's right in the middle. So yeah, you're you're going to uh, and someone coming like from a tennis background. Yeah. You get what I mean? It'll fit, kind of, so it'll it'll fit them, definitely yeah. fit them. Yeah. You're going to have that extra power. I mean, I definitely would put a little bit more weight to it because yep. then you know you're you're getting a little bit more drive. You're balancing it. It's already well balanced. Um, spin. Yeah, the spin was awesome on yes. this paddle. I mean, oh, it was just phenomenal. I think it, it had that nice combination of a good amount of dwell, so both on fast and slow balls. Yes. We were getting that that really high level spin, yes. Com yes. comparing it to some of the higher end. I was, I was, I was impressed and very satisfied oh, with yeah. the amount of spin. Yes. Uh, because you know, um, you know, sometimes what happens is when it's like thermoformed and it's more poppy, mm -hmm. you know. It doesn't stay there. You can't. You can't really get it turning. You were able to crank the revolutions yeah. on this, which I really like. So definitely very high tiered um, adaptability. What kind of player would like this? So I think you can adapt to this paddle really quickly, which is awesome. And I'm going to say who this paddle's not for. Yes. I think that's almost I think, yes, easier. Yes, 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 yes. I think if you're the type of player that you like to get into hand battles, where again, so if you want to hit a quick speed up. I don't think this is great for you because it doesn't have a lot of pop. Mm -hmm. And then with that kind of, you know, it's not the most maneuverable paddle. So I think if you're, if you're that type of player where you like to get to the kitchen, hit speed up, get in a hands battle, then I would steer away from this. Or if you're looking for a ton of, like, a really high tier of power, I'd stay away. Mm -hmm. Outside of that, I think it could be used by a really wide range yes, of players. Yes, yes, yes. I totally So it's a agree. very small section, I think should stay away from it. But outside of that, if you play a pretty standard game or a very control oriented game, it's awesome for you. Yeah, I mean, definitely you should try it. Um, you know, I think it's a very interesting paddle. We really enjoyed playing yes. with it. We liked it so much that we're going to do a giveaway. <laughs> So Ryan, how are we going to do this giveaway? So you'll have to make sure you're subscribed to the channel, mm -hmm. drop a like on this video, and then all you have to do after that is leave a comment. Yeah, yeah. We, we want those exciting comments. We have yes. loved interacting with you. Yes. We've got some great comments on Ryan's good looks and him beating up people, so we want a few more of those. Yes. Um, so please comment, we love hearing from you. This is a phenomenal paddle. You're going to get everything in this box. It's seated right here, waiting to ship. We are going to announce it on June 14th. So we'll look forward. Um, to hearing who the winner will be on today. We had an awesome time trying this yes. paddle out. The current MSRP is $219.99, and I think this paddle can fit quite a wide variety yeah. of players, and mm -hmm. we really enjoyed it. Yeah, um, we love helping people try paddles. Paddles are unique to each individual, so give it a go. If you want to try it down here in the southern Minnesota area, Rochester area, we would love uh, if you want to demo the paddle. Again, subscribe, comment, like. We love uh, hearing from you, and that's how it helps uh, growing our channel. Hope to see you in another paddle review.